Perth City councillors have been locked out of their emails and computers as the state government prepares to take over the scandal-wracked local government. One councillor's car has also been searched this afternoon. Tegan Sapple, it comes as D-Day looms on the council's suspension. Michael, the local government minister will decide tomorrow whether the city council will be suspended right away or whether he'll give them 21 days to plead their case. All councillors were today barred from accessing the city's information systems and ordered not to remove or destroy any documentation as the state prepares to move in. With just 19 hours to go until Perth City Council learns its fate, the government is taking no chances, turning up the heat on the investigation into the trouble-plagued council. The acting CEO sent this email to the Lord Mayor and councillors this afternoon, ordering them not to remove or destroy any documentation. It's understood one councillor's car was also searched. The drama unfolding as the pressure for the council to be suspended immediately grows. The Perth City Council continues to make a laughing stock of this government and this minister. Two CEOs have gone on stress leave in the last fortnight. Today, another member of the senior executive was on sick leave. And this morning, an admission from the City of Perth that representatives met with WorkSafe last year, seeking guidance to ensure a safe working environment. It's a bit like a house that's being, you know, invaded by termites. From the outside it looks fine, but there's a culture in there and there's issues that are happening which are not going to go away. The local government minister has the option of suspending the council immediately or giving it 21 days to prove itself. Councillors fighting for a second chance, blaming the Lord Mayor's travel perk scandal for causing the downfall of the entire council. But the opposition says the only option is immediate suspension. Misinformation will continue to be spread. Uh, people will be put under stress and uh, you know, the city of Perth will go nowhere. It will, it will freeze. Tegan Sapwell, Nine News.